lot of people tell me, oh my God, my dog is so afraid every time I pull out the camera. And so I tell them to put the camera on the ground and put their food next to it. Make that camera like the coolest thing that ever happened. Like when the camera shows up, you get food. And that does wonders. Use a little bit of peanut butter and just put it on their teeth and get fun pictures of them like licking their lips. Or just practice while your dog's asleep on the couch, you know? Get like a nice depth of field going and try to like focus on the eye and then get a little dramatic with it. Right now we're in the Columbia River Gorge, which is where Norbert and I go hiking a lot. When you're hiking with your pets, it's easy to get great shots. Obviously, they're usually doing something they enjoy, so they look happy. When I go hiking, I need something a little bit lighter weight, and the D5300 is actually perfect for that. So I can shoot in low light, I can shoot when it's really bright out. I like to shoot low angle, especially things like waterfalls, and the variable angle screen is great out here because it prevents me from having to roll on the ground in the woods. <laughs> I can upload the images uh, via Wi-Fi to my smart devices and then post them on social media and instantly have that available to, uh, to show my fans. Uh, so some good tips for getting a great shot when you're out with your pet. Um, you know, always bring treats because animals like treats no matter where they are, I find. Let your pet run around. Get some great shots of it just acting like an animal. Look for nice backgrounds. Look for areas that you think would be really beautiful. Even if you just have a neighborhood park, you don't need to be in the middle of the wilderness. You can just go to the park and take different original photos for every season. If things are starting to kind of fizzle out and you can't get a great shot of your dog and you're getting stressed and the dog's like, I don't know what I'm doing wrong, take a break, put the camera down, play with your dog for a minute. Just get out of this, the, the photography space and back into the I love my dog space.